good afternoon today i will uh, show you how to uh, use a drag panel extender of xx in asp.net uh, using drag panel extender we can drag any items any control so first of all we need script manager control without any script manager control we cannot use other ajax control uh, using a script manager control we can control other ajax control so it's a controller of control so here we have a single panel in which we can take another panel the inside panel we will use for handle of the panel okay so here we uh, here we will take so here we have a division inside the division we have a text that is drag me uh, just outside the panel we have another panel that's contain the text so here we have three panel two panel inside single panel so you can say that uh, a single box contain two different panel control okay so outer panel is panel one and two inside panel that is panel two and panel three so design A CSS class for drag panel that is drag panel is a class name I want to show when we uh, when we move on the division then cursor change into the move background color is gray font size font size uh, that is larger and the font align oops font oops actually that that is not a font align that is a text align text align center okay that's fine now take a drag panel extender use this class in the division uh, for your handle now take drag panel extender control from the toolkit that is mm, drag panel extender yeah now set uh, two necessary property that is target control id that uh, assigned for panel one that is the outer panel of two other panels and drag handle ID is the single panel that is the first panel inside the par panel one save this and run it your application so uh, in the mm, drag panel extender we have only two properties uh, for mandatory that is target control ID and the drag panel ID okay so thank you thank you very much for watching this video tutorials please keep watching my all other video tutorials which is related to asp.net and thank you thank you very much